example, I want to um, test this function to see if it is a one-to-one -one function. And if it is one-to-one -one function, then we can find uh, the function's inverse. Um, so the test we're going to do is we're going to um, assume that this must be true, that f of a is equal to f of b for so any a, b. Um, if it is a one-to-one -one function, it must also be true that a has to be the same thing as b. Um, for every domain, there's exactly one unique range. All right, so basically we're just going to do this first part and see if we're guaranteed this uh, second piece. If we are, it's a one-to-one -one function. So f of a in this case would be 2a cubed minus 5. f of b in this case would be 2b cubed minus 5. And then you basically just solve for a. You could solve for b, but most people would just solve for a. Well, if we solve for a, we'd add 5. Those would go away, and you'd be left with 2a cubed is equal to 2b cubed. And then divide both sides by 2, and you're left with a cubed equals b cubed. And if you cube root both sides, you end up with a equals b. And because it's not like a equals plus or minus b, or a equals a long expression with b's in it, it's just plain old a is equal to b, then we know for sure, uh, therefore, this function is 1 to 1. And therefore, it's invertible, which is very important. And that's it for this problem.